So it looks like on the latest mock draft, the Eagles at 21 will get wide receiver Jerry Judy from Alabama. Okay, Jerry Judy is another player that he could line him up outside, inside. His release is fantastic. His catchability is fantastic. His great attribute is in open space. That's where he plays a lot better. Um, with the ball in his hands, he is most likely unstoppable. I mean, nine times out of ten, you get the ball to Jerry Judy in open space, you're pretty much hitting a home run, okay? He is pretty much like Odell Beckham with the ball in his hands in open space. It's pretty phenomenal what he could do, but his release is, is so – he's very slippery. Okay, so uh, uh, defensive backs are going to be – it's going to be a mystery to, to these uh, cornerbacks in the NFL to what he's going to do. He's got so much athleticism coming off of the line. Um, that's where I like him. I like his explosiveness off the line. He's got some physicality there too. And open space. You get the ball to him in open space, and he's pretty much a mismatch on anybody. I don't even know if anyone even cover this guy. Um, it would be phenomenal if you could able to. One of these names is going to drop, okay? Because you have the uh, the Oakland, the Las Vegas Raiders taking Henry Ruggs. You have the San Francisco 49ers at 13 uh, taking C.D. Lamb, of course, which we thought because free agency actually helped the Eagles tremendously. Uh, Robbie Anderson going to the Panthers, which they were pretty much liable to get a wide receiver. Um, Kyle Murray. Um, in uh, Arizona, that has that has been C.D. Lamb's quarterback in college, so that does help as well. Um, getting the DeAndre Hopkins trade done, you know what I mean. So uh, they have Christian Kirk, Larry Fitz is still there. Um, so they're you know Kenyon Drake in the backfield. So they're they're pretty much set offensively. I think they're pretty damn good offensively. So I see them getting an edge rusher or going uh, for an offensive guard or a tackle, or whatever. I don't really know their offensive line too much, but I know it's not good right now. As well as the Panthers, Panthers are probably going to get interior defensive lineman, defensive tackle most likely, or defensive end either or. They need it. Need a better pass rush. So free agency and trades have helped the Philadelphia Eagles tremendously at twenty one whether they have enough ammo to move up um, in this draft and get something done. But Jerry Judy, I would not mind it. I would welcome it. I would welcome Jerry Judy, Henry Ruggs. See, see look, I'm not picky like a lot of a lot of fans are. I'm really not. Um, I think, you know, I think CD has a lot to the table. I think Ruggs can bring a lot to the table too. And it's not just his speed and his 40 time and everything like that because the fastest players um, aren't going to make or break you, okay? We have fast players in this league that can't, run routes and can't do the important things, which is technique in the NFL. You bring in a guy like Jerry Judy, you get explosiveness off the line and open space is where you're going to want him at his value. And you give him the ball in open space and pretty much he's, he's out of there. Okay. He's going to get a lot of chunk yards, a lot of yak yards. He, he's a, gr a great route runner. Um, he takes great angles at getting as many yards as possible. So very hard for linebackers or, or slot receivers or outside corner or, or I mean slot corners or outside corner, whatever the hell you, you want to line them up in, in this offense. Um, cause I know we'll have two open spots at wide receiver with Alshon Jeffrey probably on his way out by June. That's what I'm hoping that's going to happen. So getting Jerry Judy to me is it's, it's a luxury. Um, but it's a need. It's, it's a, obviously we need receiver badly. This is the best draft. Okay. I think at 30, I think Denzel Mims is drafted by the Green Bay Packers. Um, Justin Jefferson wasn't even, uh, didn't even get. There's so many different needs. There's some teams taking linebackers. Teams, there's there's some teams out there that are, are going to be taking defensive ends, defensive tackles. Uh, you know, a couple corners. Okuda and C.J. Henderson will probably be first round picks. So I mean, really, the Eagles are set up so damn perfectly. Free agency and trades have helped this team tremendously. Um, moving forward to the draft. The draft is very, very close, and um, I can't wait to see which one of these players we're going to be admiring for a long time, and I hope it's a superstar, and I hope it's a guy that is going to flourish in this offense. Um, I think we're, you know whatever receiver that does come here is going to be set up with everything all around with two great tight ends, a, a top three offensive line, a quarterback in Carson Wentz that can extend plays. You have two speed backs in Miles Sanders, Boston Scott, whatever bruiser they want, and Elijah Holyfield or whoever else they want to maybe draft later on if they do draft another running back later on. 
Um, they're, they're set up pretty, you know, Deshaun Jackson on the other side. So obviously you get Jerry Judy in the building, man. He can learn a lot from Deshaun Jackson. You can, you can learn a lot just by playing with this team. And I just want to see one of the, one of these guys drafted. Uh, obviously that's what I want to see. One of these high profile guys drafted. I understand that, you know, it, it's not going to be easy moving up in this draft. I think there are trade up value. I think there are some trade up teams like the Panthers, like the uh, uh, Cardinals, um, you know what I mean? Like, you know, maybe jumping in front of the Broncos, maybe trading with the Buccaneers. I have no idea. Um, but there are plenty of options. And I think, you know, if the Eagles actually get this pick and draft Jerry Judy, I'm going to be excited. Whether it's Ruggs, Lamb, or Judy, or whatever. I mean, I'm going to be excited. I'm, I like Justin Jefferson. I like T. Higgins a lot. I like all these guys. Now, Jalen Rieger might be a first-round pick. I don't know. Um, his... his his value is going up. His stock, his stock value is going up. His draft stock is just is going through the roof right now. He put out a video today um, of his workouts and what's going on. He only weighs like he's not even like two hundred pounds, like one hundred ninety something pounds. Is he's very lean, uh, very fast. Four point two eight, I think he ran. Um, so I don't know. Someone might take a chance on Jalen Rieger. That could happen from TCU. Um, so we'll see what happens. But Jerry Judy coming to the Philadelphia Eagles, I, I wouldn't mind it at all. I'd welcome it, and I'd welcome to this team in a heartbeat. So what do you guys think about Jerry Judy? Is that the right pick at 21? Do you think the Eagles still trade up? But you know what? At least tell me, guys, at 21, where do you think that this will – I guess how this will transpire. So other than that, guys, that's it. I will see you guys later. Shake squad up. Fly, I'll fly.